You actually camping is very scary. You know what I'm saying? I tried to, to contest game four. Um, and she, her sword and her long aerials just outboxed me. So I was like, okay, she doesn't, she has one. What? So, um, what he I, say? I, I was right on the money. Oh, too. it's a button mash. Um, I was right on the money too. After game four, I was like, you know what? If I was Micah, I would take corn to Kalos. Sure enough. Yeah. Well, she banned F, FD and, um, and Smashville. So I was uh, like, I, I wanted a long stage. <laughs> I don't want to get juggled and have those extensions going on with I the with the up airs. I would have banned FD in town. Well, I couldn't go back to town because I won on that last. Oh, with modified yeah, DSR, right. you can't do that. Yep. Yep, but right. either way, I'm on winner's side of grand final, so I'm chilling. I will be right back. I'm going to go get a water. How his tag is choker. Why would he up smash there? I don't know. Also wondering why he went Samus and not Joker. Did his Joker have a bad loss tonight or something? Did his... back onto the commentary. Right now it's looking like a very close game one. Um, I don't know why Marfinator is choosing to play Samus did, instead of Joker. Did he have a bad loss tonight as Joker? He, he literally just lost to me. Is that a bad loss to him? Uh, it shouldn't be. I'm literally seated first in the tournament. Oh. But I know he's been frustrated. Lately, especially because he was up 2-0 against me, and then he got reverse 3-0'd. So that might be one of the reasons why, but I'm really not sure. Ugh. He's having a Zawa moment. What's that? What's a Zawa moment? The frustration. What you frustrated about? Dude, I SD'd like five times in once. You know, you know, Kenthusius SD'd against Summoner uh, four times, two times each stock. Yeah, I I literally gave what's his name shovel like a game and a half worth of fucking stock. Well, stocks. Yeah. Yeah. got not SD. <laughs> it is what it is. But uh, back to this game, we have a uh, we have Summoner with a slight lead right now, but uh. Arfinator bringing that back real quick. Especially if a charge shot hits, that's going to do about 20%. And even it, the stocks, or even the percent right back up. Oh, dare bear. Not going to kill too early for percent, but great damage to add on. I don't think charge shot would kill by the quite yet. Oh, it won't. You, you need to get like a confirm into it just to get some extra percent added on. But after the confirm, it might be. I like the little shoot, 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 and then cover the jump approach because how else are you going to get past it? It was a pretty good coverage coming out from Morphinator there. It uh, works against a lot of people. Oh, the up out of shield. Not going to get punished. The up smash doesn't have enough hit, uh, side hitbox range. And so uh, that up B, even though unsafe, goes unpunished. 
Now, I would have expected to see an up out of shield there. But, uh, I guess Marfinator's thinking three steps ahead. <laughs> Get the old ledge pressure up out here and run up up here. That up here is stale as, cra as crap. That's very stale. Like that ain't gonna. Oh, going for the up tilt. I like it, but not gonna not gonna kill or connect. Him. Not seeing a lot of um, down smash. Yeah, I would like to see. I would like to like see Marfinator up throw actually. Up throw or down smash. Uh, looks like. The non stale up air <laughs> immediately kills. <laughs> I feel like some a lot of Samus's don't like it, but in a matchup like this, it does make your, your box a little smaller. Yeah. And it covers a decent amount of space. Ooh, Zare in the up air. I liked that a little. It works. That was, that was cute. Ooh, back air gonna clank with the Nair. Not what Summoner was wanting. But, uh,. Marfani are sporting about a hundred percent lead here. We're gonna have to see if a uh, summoner, oh, summoner going super hard, giving up stage control, and now about to get juggled. Went for a home run swing right there, and unfortunately, it ended up a strike. We're not seeing a lot of uh, upbeats to catch Marfinator in the air. Maybe he's saving it for later. Yeah, I would. I would like to see a few of those too. Uh, we saw them in the set against Summoner versus Mrs. Bully. I bet and money before. he's saving it for later. I hope so. I hope he just isn't thinking about it. He's probably seeing what Marfinator does with the up air. Oh! Using the oh. using the um charge shot hit stun to get a confirmed grab into a quick up throw. Not di it was it it was diable, but Lind or Summoner was not ready for it whatsoever. So great great quick up throw. Uh it's a very underrated confirm in the grab. Yeah. You don't even see Marfinator do it that much, actually. <sighs> Y'all doing uh, some research for Daniel's run? Crimson. Code Crimson. Ooh, Demento. I think Demento is a Soul Aegis. Dark Pit. Ah. Oh. Oh, nice. Get the practice. I have to fight a Jukebox Hero, Incineroar Kazuya, so I think I'm gonna go Luigi for it. Um, and if I win that, I have to fight the third seed of the tournament, Mugen, the Roy. But so I really want to fight Juke. I really want to beat Jukebox, not because it'd be an upset win, but I want to fight Mugen. I want as much high-level practice as possible. I'm gonna go Inkling against the Roy for sure. I hope I hope I want to take a game if I can. I pop the fuck off. Oh, frick! Sorry, sorry. Banned. All right, goodbye. Huh? No. 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 I I would be extremely ecstatic. And I try not to show it because I'm sure he'd be tilted if at the loss. But like, I'd be very happy. I have popped off, I think, less than ten times. The first time I beat Fusion, I popped off. The first time I beat Craig, I popped off. Um, first time I beat Pulley, I think I did a small pop off. <laughs> The first time I beat Moppin, I popped off. Well, this is back in Smash 4. Hey. Let's go. But, uh, we need to, we need to talk about this, the match real quick. Um. It's even. We're good. It, it is actually pretty close. Um, this oh, is looking Mark. a lot reminiscent of the, uh, This is looking reminiscent of the first game where Summoner had the lead for a large part of it, but towards the end, uh, Marfinator just turned on another gear and was able to close it out. So we'll have to see if Summoner is able to avoid falling back into that again. Um, getting hit by that charge shot, not a good start. What time is it? Is it going by fast? This is loser semis. 
Yeah, we'll finish around the same time we always finish. Like, I mean, we're at the last one, the last Thursday. Uh, well, as long as you keep having top six best of five. As long as we don't have like a reset. This was a, this is a stacked one too. Like everyone, um, yeah. Like uh, having Sunday here was a surprise. You and Calzone entering was a was good. Then you have like Fusion, Pulley, me, Summoner. I I did not think I was going to be on winner's side of grand finals. Back throw gonna kill. Wow. I didn't think that was a kill throw for Samus. Okay, Sunday SD. Okay. No, no, nothing to Daniel. I think Sunday's a really good player. Oh, Sunday had a Zawa moment? <laughs> it, it was... Karma. There's been so many SDs tonight from a lot of people. It's, 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 it's the Zawa tech. That's it's the only the reason I'm on tech. winner's side of Grand Finals, because I didn't SD. Because Pulley sd to get Summoner Ah, once. damn. Yeah, I'm banned. I would have won for real. Yeah, if you entered, if you ever entered a gosh darn tournament, Timbo, you might have won. Gosh darn. If it was your Fox versus me in finals, it was it's game over. Timbo. Huh? I'm trying I mean, really hard. We we played twice this week. Now, I clapped it? its cheeks the first time. He clapped my cheeks the second time. Huh? Like I couldn't beat it with my Inkling or Palu. It was only Luigi. I don't know. And that was the day I was feeling really bad. But I also think Timbo was just playing really well. Yeah. It's of course free entry money. <laughs> what? The study tournament tomorrow. Oh. Uh, you want to fight me in bracket or friendlies? Tomorrow. Yeah. Depending if there's only eight people entering again. <laughs> huh? I mean, from, yeah, the city of Auburn, at some point they are watching it. We never know when. That's why we're watching our language 24 7. That's the average, probably. Look what? From what city? Wait, is is this? Does this mean after hours, bannable words can be said? After hours. What show? What show is? Oh, that? yes. Um, thank, thank the Lord that Marfanier switched to Joker. I am sick of his Samus. I'm saying it right now, Marf, for when you vod review. I'm looking at you too. You don't know this, but I'm looking right at you. Stop playing Samus. Your Joker is infinitely better. <laughs> yeah, that's 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 exactly what Pulley said. The secret text she wanted to tell me was because I can do that against you a know, lot of people apparently. So I, it's gonna take a little while for me to try to implement it, but I want to. You know? Huh? Yeah. Or, or just a linear recovery, she said. It works on Falco and Fox, apparently. Well, Timbo, I believe that uh, Christopher had the first idea of playing yeah. Joker at my home. So I can take credit for anything. I'll take credit for this. But uh, Summoner, even though Marfanator switched to Joker, uh, Summoner used to be a Joker main, so... Uh, Nothing is going to be thrown at him that is going to be surprising. This matchup to me. Oh, is... <laughs> that was such a that was such a raw option. No. Oh my goodness. Good Lord. What a no. what a hit. And you know, Summoner now has the momentum in his favor. Oh yeah, that. man. He's. Is he, I'm hoping he runs away with it because that's what I would do if I got s such a raw call out in neutral. Sheesh. A down air, man. How much does that downer do? It has to do 30. It has. It's probably like high 20s, low 30s. It's it's it, it's crazy. Okay. 
Okay, we got down, down throw back in. Oh. Yeah, Marfinator Joker, man. I I love playing against it. Oh, it's, oh was that another down air? He down aired Arsene uh, up B, yeah. And you know, Marfinator just lost with Joker and just lost with Samus. Um, it's there's one, a high chance he's feeling demoralized right now. It's one two, yes. Uh, yeah, two one Summoner's favor. Yeah. Great stuff to Summoner. Uh, not letting the Joker switch get to him. And uh, now we have. If you both agree to it. It's modified DSR. Still, gentlemen, the stage that you want to play on, though. You both agree? Yeah, but the reason he's asking is because he doesn't want it. Oh, because they didn't ban it. Because they didn't rock, paper, scissors to it. Okay, okay. If you gentlemen to PS2, you can return to PS2. I w you know That's what I'm what gonna I was do? Saying. Like if my round one at Co Crimson, I'm gonna be like, gentlemen's the gamer. <laughs> gentlemen's to WarioWare. <laughs> Found a dreams is fine. Just don't play freaking Wario Dittos. you will be fine. <laughs> if I switch back to Samus, the Joker f not feeling like the play. I'll if I keep playing Terry, I might ban PS2. I feel like, uh, honestly, I feel like Marfinator's, uh, struggling here with, with a, kind of like a character crisis, even though the Samus is now looking pretty good when it wasn't in game two. It just, I mean, they're not able to get a footing. They're too busy switching characters to be able to adapt properly. There's, there's uh, a little bit of that. I do think he's trying to figure stuff out. I definitely think him and Fusion are in a similar place character-wise right now. Just uh, unsure about what direction they want to take. They definitely have their tastes. Like they don't, they don't deviate too far from what they seem to like. Yeah, I think you are correct on that. The but least thing I've done. Right now, it's looking extremely even. Uh, well, we're gonna have to just see who can get the first hit in neutral to start running away with it a little bit because right now it's just a little bit of a blow for blow kind of action going on. Forward air gonna give him the stage control. Be reverse into forward air, nice pressure. Bomb trap at the ledge. Tries to go for the roll read. Summoner, not gonna give it. Oh, good call out on the directional air dodge. Sweet spot F smash gonna take it, and Marfinator having a a solid two stock lead. Are we gonna see game five? Uh, if get if the game continues going this way, yeah. And good parry into up B because that that nair was not done hitting, but the parry allowed for the hit stun to come out for the up B to be able to hit. Yeah. Oh, good call out. These directional air dodges are getting punished really hard by Marfinator right now, and he's up a full stock. These are really good call outs because Summoner keeps directionally air dodging back to the stage, and it's, it's pretty predictable, and Marfinator getting, getting on it and punishing it properly. Great stuff. Raw up air, good call out neutral, and the weak forward air actually gonna take it. Uh, Violet this game's with, not over yet. Violet with rage is not a thing you wanna mess with. Nope, and it's looking like Lint or Summoner is getting the momentum back in their favor. So if I'm Marfinator, I wanna close this stock out ASAP. Yep, f fair, fair, and now you're off stage. That was a little bit of a cheeky option. That down there was never gonna hit. Nair dash attack, and the game's even. Just like that, Summoner Ooh, now has- that back air was just, mm, it was right there. Summoner time. looking a little antsy, going for that raw up smash tr call out, trying to get something Ooh, going. Ooh, that shield damage. That hurts so much. And that's such a good option to do on the platform too. Oh yeah. Especially because Samus up smashes the way that it is. 
We're not seeing like any grabs coming out from either player. Also, they're just swinging. They're just swinging. They're swinging. <laughs> Guns of blade. Look, another up smash, and Nair gonna take it. Oh, man. Good stuff to Morphinator. No, I, that, I that, really. That was back here. No, it was Nair. Um, you just you just saw the. the oh, one I, I hit. saw the. Back it was the hit. first hit of the yeah, Nair. Yeah, yeah. Um, I'm dumb. But I really didn't like how panicked Summoner was getting there. If you saw, he brought it back to even and then started just fishing really hard for smash attacks for no reason. You saw it twice, two up smashes. And it's like, you were playing so well into just that. And you also had the momentum from bringing the game. You, you were down 100%, and then you brought it. You took. You dealt 100% without taking a single percent of damage that whole stock. So to see to see such a good comeback to be stifled by your own panicking was a little. It hurt to see a little bit. I think they're getting in each other's heads right now a little bit. Um, I definitely. I honestly. I don't think Marf is in Lindsay's head. I think Summoner is in their own head a little bit there. Um, I do think Summoner was in Arf's head a little bit, but after that game, I'm not so sure anymore. Because we have Game 5, Battlefield. And I think both of these characters like Battlefield. Both of them are able to extend their combos and uh, shark with their multi-hit up airs. <laughs> and these uppies out of shield are paying dividends to get 47 un unanswered percent right now. And uh, this is looking a little rough for summoner right now and this would be a this would be a big win for marfinator if he wins because uh that that'll be a second upset of the day uh he upset fusion and then, and then now look looking like he could upset uh summoner as well zare and fair gonna shield poke really nice stuff weak hit in air and these multi-hits are really hard for Summoner to deal with, it seems. Uh, he keeps getting shield poked or letting go of shield before the hit's finally done. And uh, I think, yep, just right there again, letting go before the up air's done. I think trying to panic and wanting to punish the option and just not l waiting long enough. Down tilt up air, second up air, not going to connect. Good patience. But that sweet Ooh, spot that back, back air, going to take it. And now if I'm Summoner, I'm playing patient i want to sustain my lead Circle camp. but marfinator's not letting him Circle camp. <laughs> <laughs> oh miss him put the upbeat sad was all a moment nice 32 <coughs> percent and this game even though Summoner took the first stock, is now firmly back in Marfinator's hands with about a 40% lead. Ooh, but this edge guard, and I think, nope, still took the jump. Got hit by the missile, so able to get back onto the stage for free. That's a. That, that might was, be a little costly. That was good missile placement by Mara. It was great, yes, absolutely. Oh, that shield poked, it hit his head! Yeah. Great, great placement of the neutral B by Marfinator, too. And Marfinator's Summoner's looking a little antsy here, and Marfinator's just playing patient. Oh! Oh! Now, now that was some parkour. Oh! That was some parkour oh! right oh! there. But the forward air gonna take it. Yeah, he's really looking for Summoner to jump right now. And Summoner giving it to him almost every time. Yeah, Marf's just playing the corner right now, and I have no issue with it. It's I exactly love perfect timing of, of, of the get up to not get hit by the down smash either. And the de the bomb delay to not get sniped. Marfinator playing amazing right now. Summoner really has to do something to bring this back. Getting called out for their jump every single time. Again. Again. <laughs> you jump, you get hit. You jump, you get hit. And yeah, that's, that's going to take it. Crumbled. Marfinator, a two stock to take the set over Summoner and you know Summoner's probably feeling a bit frustrated but it was great